Let's walk through together how you can use the max function in Excel. It's relatively straightforward. So let's imagine we want, we're looking at this data that we see here on the left. And so we have various people, and we have their scores on the exams. But Dana does not have a score. And Deanna down here doesn't have a score. In fact, it's a true-false statement. So the neat thing about max is max actually will ignore those, either spaces or something that says true. Let me just show you. It's very simple and straightforward. You just type equals max. That's going to give me the largest number. I'm going to highlight everything other than Deanna at the bottom. We know that the highest number there is 100 with mark. And there we go. Again, the function just as max, and then you highlight the range that you want the max value from. Now, let me just change that to include Deanna. So I'm changing C12 to C13. And you can see it still works. There you go. That's how you use the max function.